Sri Rudra Uvacha, Jitam Taat Mavidvarya, Swastaye Swastirastume, Bhavata Radhasa Radham, Sarvasma Atmane Nama. Beautiful Rudra said, Your auspiciousness conquers all, bringing supreme auspiciousness to those who know themselves. You are the beloved lover, the self of all. Nama. Nama Pankajanabhaya, Buddha Sukshmendiyatmane, Vasudevaya Shantaya, Kutas Taya Swarochise. Vasudevaya Nama. The lotus from your navel is the true self of every object in every sense for your consciousness, yet ever peaceful, self-contained, and self-delighted. Sankarshanaya Sukshmaya Durantayantakaya Cha Namo Vishva Prabodhaya Pradyumnyan Dharadmane Though beyond beginning or end, you integrate and disintegrate the essence of all things. Namo Namo Niruddhaya Rishikeshen Driyatmane Aniruddhaya Nama You are the true form of the mind, which is the master sense. So meditate upon how your consciousness is Vishnu. Meditate upon how your ego is Vishnu. Meditate upon how your intellect is Vishnu. And from Vishnu, request full use of it. Swarga Pavarga Dwaraya Mityam Shichi Shade Namaha Namo Hiranya Viryaya Chatur Hutraya Tantave You are the ultimate sun, nourishing and maintaining all beings. You always purify everything with your mighty golden glow. You are the thread from which the four ceremonies are woven into cloth. Thus you are the gateway to heaven and liberation. Nama urja ishe trayaha pataye yagya retase tripti daya chajiva nam nama savar satmane You are the ultimate moon, the true essence of flavor, quenching the thirst of all beings, the maintainer of the fertile triplicity, fluidity, viscosity, and reproductive fluid. Sarva Sattvatma Dehaya Visheshaya Staviyase Namas Trailokya Palaya Saha Ojo Balaya Cha He says you are the ultimate earth, which is the essence of all solid forms by which things can be differentiated. You are the ultimate air, the joiner of earth to space, enlivener of intellectual, emotional, and physical strength. Arta Lingaya Nabase Namo Antar Bahir Atmane Nama Punyaya Lokaya Amushmai Bhuri Varchase so space gives shape to meaning or consciousness or knowledge. The essence of the inside and the outside is space. Punya, the least physical of all of these physical elements, is space. So the space element, which is responsible for sound, allows the arta or the meaning that's in my head to take a shape that can be transmitted to you. And what is that? How does that happen? By Amushmai Bhuri say this other type of wave, light wave, which is a sound wave. Pravrittaya nivrittaya pitridevaya karmane namo dharma vipakaya mrityave dhukkadaya cha. You are the ability to achieve good results by positive and negative action. And you are the ability also to achieve dukkha and mṛtta. Dukkha and mṛtta are sadness and death. Because you learn from this, you learn from your suffering what's the adharma, 
and you learn from your uh, success and good results what is Dharma. Namaste Ashisham Isha Manave Karanatmane Namo Dharmaya Brate Krishna Ya Kuntamedase Purushasya Puranaya Sankhya Yogeshwaraya Cha So Rudra says, Namaste to the master and essence of supreme fulfillment of deeds and desires. Namaste to the realest of the real, to Krishna, the original person whose heart is never troubled because he is the master of knowledge and 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 it's in action. And putting it into action. He also says, Shakti Traya Sametaya Midhushe Hankritatmane Cheta Cheta akuti rupaya namo vacho viputi. Namaste you to you who nourish the three energies that manifest the self's individuality. You are the true form of all the words and objects that excite the mind. Starshanam no didrikshuram didrikshunam dehi bhagavatarchitam rupam priyatamam swanam sarvendriya. Gunanjanam. I want to see you the way your beloved see you. Please show me that beauty that delights and soothes all the senses of your most intimate and beloved friends. He then says, Snigdha pravrit ganashyamam sarva sundarya sangraham charvayuta Chatur Bahu Sujataruchirananam Padmakosha Palaksha Palasha Ksham Sundara Bru Sunaskam Sudvijam Sukapolasyam Samakarna Vipushanam Your complexion glistens like a thick black cloud full of water from the ocean of all beauty and about to burst in a downpour of affection. Your arms elegantly extend to the four directions and your face is like the center of a delightful, noble lotus flower. Priti prahasita pangam alakai rupa shobitam Lasat pankaja king jalka dukula mrishtakundalam. From behind beautiful curls of hair, loving glances peek out. Cloth and earrings sparkle like glistening lotus saffron. Spurat kirita valaya hara nupura mekala. Shankha Chakra Gada Padma Mala Man Yuttama Rittimat. And he says, You are enriched with the finest accessories. Crowns, a crown, bracelets, necklaces of flowers and pearls, anklets, belts, and a conch, a disc, a club, and a lotus. Then he says, Singha skanda tisho biprat sobag kyagriva kostubam shriyana paina kshita nikashas mo rasolasat. These accessories glitter on your wide lion like shoulders. While the kostuba gem graces your neck. And then on the chest, there's a streak left by the goddess of beauty. Pura recha kasang vignya vali valku dalodaram pratisankramayad vishvam nabhyavarta kapiraya. Now he says, your abdomen, which is the udara, your abdomen is flat and wide like a banyan leaf. As he's breathing, this 
the abdomen moves in and out a lot and these lines come and go your navel twirls so deep that the universe seems to fall back into it continuing your black hips are excessively delightful. Adhirochishnu. Your black hips are excessively delightful with golden belt and cloth. Your delicate feet, calves, knees, and thighs are a joy to behold. Pada Sharat Padma Palasha Rochisha Nakadibir non dar Agham Vidhun Vata Vidarshaya Sri Yamapasta Sadvasam Padam Guru Marga Gurus Tamo Jusham. Your feet are like the autumnal lotus. Now, it goes on to say that the toes of the feet are like the f- petals of the flower. And then he says the gloss from the shine of your toenails. So that's the way that the autumnal lotus gets rid of the mud. Similarly, the way the shine the t- from the toenails disperses the, the mud or the inner darkness. Then he says, Rudra requests, raise your heel a little bit because I want to see the bottom of your foot. Raise your heel to show us the sole of your foot which destroys all the worries of we darkness dwellers. Etad rupam anudhyayam atma shudhim abhipshatam yad bhakti yogo payada svadharman anutishtatam. Then he says, if you want to realize your pure self and attain your true nature, devotedly meditate on this form, which bestows certainty. He says, Bhavan Bhakti Mata Labhyo Durlabha Sarva Dehinam Sarajasyapya Bhimata Ekane Tatma Vidgati. So Rudra Shiva says, The gods wish for it. The self knowers strive to become one with it, but only the power of love can achieve it. Let's see. So the next thing he says is Tam Duraradhya Maradhya Satamapi Durapya Ikanta Bhaktya Kovanchet Padamulam Vinabahi. This is why even the greatest people strive for such love, even though it's so rare. Who would desire anything else or any sense of love not, not rooted in you? Yatra Nirvishtam Aranam Kritanto Nabhimanyate Vishvam Vidvamsayam Virya Sorya Vispurjita Bhruva. Time is so powerful and forceful that it destroys everything. with less effort than it takes to flick an eyebrow. But time loses all confidence when it comes to this pure love. Kshanar dhinapi tulye naswargam napunar bhavam bhagavat sangi sangasya martyanam kim utashisha Neither paradise nor even liberation from rebirth can compare to the value of being truly close to one who is truly close to the all-attractive. There simply is no higher ambition for any mortal. So... Please grant us the affection of intimate connection 
to those whose sympathetic hearts and deeds are pure, inside and out, washed in the sacred waters of their impeccable attraction to your immaculate feet. Nayasya chittam bahirartha vibhramam tamo ghuyang tamo ghayan cha vishuddhama vishat yad bhakti yoga anugrtham na yad bhakti yoga anugrihitama anjasa munir vichashte nanu tatrate gatim the completely pure hearts of such people are not motivated for any extrinsic pra- uh, profit. Nor are they bored to sleep. They are thrilled to be gratified and favored by love itself, which certainly pulls you into their contemplative perceptions. Yatredam vyajate vishvang vishvasmin avabhati yat. Tatvam Brahma Param Jyoti Akasham Eva Vistratam You are Brahman, the Supreme Light. Everything that exists is an expression of it, of Brahman. This is a real interesting statement, what he says. Everything that exists is an expression of it, and thus it shines within everything. It is similar to space of which every physical thing is an expression and embodiment. Yo ma yayedam pururu bayasrijat bibharti puya kshapayat yavikriya yad bheda buddhi sadivatma dushtaya tam atmatantram bhagavan pratimahi He says, Brahman, which is consciousness itself, is unchanging and unalterable. Yet, it's the power from which multitudes of changing forms pour forth, are sustained, and are dissolved. These forms can confuse and fragment our identities, or they can establish and express it. I want to comprehend all these forms in relation to you, Bhagavan and establish my identity in that way. Kriya kalapair idameva yoginaha shuddhanvita sadhu yajanti siddhaye bhutendriyanta karanopalakshtam vede chitantre chata eva kovidaha Those who are wise and expert have techniques and conceptions that allow them to utilize the things manifest by Brahman, physical things, and the internal and external tools for interacting with them as indirect forms of you. Thus they can wholeheartedly and expertly engage with you through their actions and thoughts in a wonderful way that yields the perfection I seek. Tam eka adya purusha sutta shaktis Taya raja sattva tamo vibhidyate Mahanaham kam Marudagnivar dhara Surasyayo bhutagana idam yata You are the original conscious being and your singular inherent latent power splits into three kinetic energies perceptivity, sattva, motivation, rajas, and solidity, tamas these interact to produce awareness and identity, which produce space, air, fire, water, and earth, which are the basis for the bodies of living creatures like gods and sages who shape the universe into what it has become. Srishtam svashatyedam anupravishtas chatur vidham puram atmangshakena ato vidustam purusham santamantar When your power creates the potential for such life forms, then fractions of you permeate them and come to know themselves as citizens in four types of cities, enjoying their faculties as a bee enjoys honey. Saesha lokan atichandavego 
vikar vikara shasi tvam kalu kalayana butani buter anumeya tatvo ganavali vairiva vishayaha they do not perceive you at all that's what we're ignorant of they do not perceive you at all but can guess that you exist it's because some great power beyond their control undoes everything that they do like clouds in the wind as a result of the destiny acquired by one living being living at the expense of another Anybody knows the Sanskrit is going to get scared here. Tam apramatta sahasabi padyase kshuleliha no here. Here. Yahakum antaka. Say they're completely enthralled and obsessed with thoughts of how they can fulfill their unbridled greed and desire for objects of enjoyment. And you, unaffected by such things, put an end to their madness. Like a snake grabbing a mouse, time grabs us all of a sudden. And the snake is which means licking its lips. So the next thing he says is Kastvat Padabjam Vijahati Pandito Yaste Vamana Vyayamana Ketana Vishanka Yasmad Guru Architis Mayat Vino Papatim Manavash Chatur Dasha Since disregarding you causes such destruction what educated person would avoid respecting your lotus feet? My guru worshipped you. Having no doubts about this. The 14 manus do this without hesitation. Ata tvam asi no brahman. Paramatman vipashitam. Vishvam rudra bhaya dvashtam. Akutashchit bhaya gati. So he says, in conclusion, ata, this is the end, the conclusion of the whole thing is, the whole universe is terrified of the destruction, the whole universe, Vishva, everybody, everything is terrified, Bhaya, of the destruction, Tvashta, that I, Rudra, am responsible for. Rudra is the agent of Vishnu that en enacts all this destruction. So he says, in conclusion, the universe is terrified of the destruction that I, Rudra, enact. So the smartest thing we can do, if you're vipashit, if you're smart, then you'll do this. The smartest thing we can do is seek fearlessness, akutashchitpaya, gati. Try to seek something fearless in you. Atatvam asi. Who is consciousness itself, Brahman, and the Supreme Person, Paramatma.